Hi there, Wendy here from Draw So Cute. In this video, we're going to draw some Frosties. So let's get started. With this drawing, we're going to first start by drawing the lip of one of the cups. So right here, I'm going to draw a very flattened out curve just all the way across. And then I'm just going to bring it down with an angle. So this is going to be the side of the cup now. So I'm going to go about both sides. So just try to make it a little bit more even, so step by step, and keep bringing it down. All the way. And a bit more. Say so about that long. So it's like drawing a cup. And yep, and then now I can just go ahead and connect it for the bottom of a curve. So basically you have a little cup right there. And then let's come up here now and we're just going to draw the frosty. So I'm going to come up here and just basically drawing curves to make these mounds. One, let's see here, one big one now. And we're just going to go up, have a little wave, and then bring it back down. And two more on this side. And back inside. So then from there, let's um, bring this frosty cut to life. So I'm going to come over here on this um, edge right here and draw his face. So I'm going to come right here for the first eye. It's a very happy eye, so it's just a curve out. And so we're going to slant it a little bit, just a tiny bit over here, and draw the other eye. So I'm just going to go in there and thicken it up. There. And then let's just come right in the center here and draw a big old smile for this very, very happy Frosty. And I'm just going to come up here very lightly and just add two little curves to anchor the eyes. So then from there, let's draw his legs. So we're going to come down here and just draw a little curve and add a little foot. So a very simple foot, just a elongated dot and so same thing over here with a curve and another elongated dot okay so then from there let's draw the um, box the gift that he's holding so to make it easier I'm basically going to come to about the center right here and I'm going to draw the same angle as this line I'm going to come up right close up to this cup and I'm going to draw same angle. So this is going to be the beginning of the box. I'm just going to imagine a drawing kind of like a square at an angle. So let's see here. I'm going to come down to this side and connect it and then about how thick I want it. So I'll just go up now. So I'm just following the same angle and I'm going to connect it. So when you connect it, the top lid is going to be a little bit wider. So you can just come out, make it a little bit longer. And then once again, you're just going to pop in a little lid right here. So it's going to be shorter, but following the same angle once again and connect it for the top of the box. Then from there, let's draw the bow right in the center. So let's find our center, say about right here. And I'm going to draw a little curve. And then from there, I'm just kind of pop out some very simple loops for my bow. And then you can come in here, let's draw another loop in here for some details. And then let's draw the ribbon. So in the center right here, I'm just going to add this ribbon and then it's going to go all the way down. like that. So I got this little box in. And so then let's make this frosty holding this um, box. So say about right here, I'm going to start to draw a curve for his hand. So about right here, let's bring out a curve all the way to the box. And then just once again, draw elongated dot. And then the back of the hand, the other hand would be about like say right here and just draw a little curve. So let's make this look more like a cup and just round this part off. Okay, and then let's come in here 
If you want, you can leave it like this, but if you can, if it's not too hard, you can just go ahead and give this cup a little edge. Go all the way over. And pop out the corner right there. And then you can just come in here and just finish off the line very lightly. And of course, if you want, I know it's a frosty, but you can always add stuff to it, right? Because <laughs> this is a draw so cute frosty <laughs> inspired by Wendy's. So here, I'm gonna add some sprinkles, whatever you like. Okay, so now to draw the other frosty. We're gonna um, bring this frosty really close to this box. So it's basically going to be the same size. So just come, take this angle, I mean this point right here, and just go right across and give yourself a point. So this is gonna be the top now, and we're gonna be really close to this box. I'm just gonna come here and draw this angle. So I'm gonna start with an angle so I kinda know and I'm going to come across so that and about right there so that they're about the same size. So now that you have this angle line established, you want to draw the other side first. So let's imagine about the same thickness. So let's say about, and it's going to be at an angle. It's going to be slightly tilted. So I'm just going to go up a little bit, say about right, uh, right there. Give, give myself a point and from here I'm going to draw the other angle to match this on the other side. So I'm going to come here and okay so that looks about right so I'm going to bring this down just play with this part a little bit it might be a little bit tricky and then um, keep coming down here all the way down And so there. So it's basically the same cup, but just tilted at a slight angle. So then let's come up here now that we have it established. Let's connect this. So let's go ahead and connect this big curve for the top of our frosty cup. And then the same thing over here. And connect it. There. <laughs> A little bit tricky. Just play around with it. Okay, so there, we got the top part. Now let's bring um, this frosty to life. And first let's put the frosty inside. So we're gonna come up once again, the same thing. It's just a curve, however you like it. And once again, go go up and wave it down and come back inside. And so then once again, let's just bring this in and follow this lip part to give our cup a little edge and pop it out. Okay, there. And then now let's um, bring this little cup to life. So once again, towards this side here, we're going to give it some draw secure eyes so about right here and draw a circle. Go across, you're gonna be slightly at an angle because this is at a um, slight tilt. So I'm gonna come about right there and draw my other eye. There, so notice it's at a slight um, angle. And so then let's make them draw so cute eye. So two small circles inside for highlights and a curve line at the bottom. So this drawing is because I was very inspired by Wendy's Frosties. I went to um, I went through a drive-thru today to buy some chicken sandwiches <laughs> and I saw this really cute little flyer that they had on the window and I took a picture of it because I had to draw it for you guys. It was just the cutest thing ever. So hopefully you guys love it too. And I thought it was so perfect because it's Christmas and then and this little guy's giving this Frosty a gift, right? So it's perfect little drawing. Okay, so the eyes. And the uh, little curve at the top for the, uh, to anchor the eyes. And let's come right here in the center and I'm going to draw a very happy smile. It's a little curve and a big U to connect it. And then a little curve inside. 
Okay, so and then you can go in there with some cheeks if you want when you're coloring it. And then let's give it some hands. So I'm going to come say about right here. And I'm going to draw a curve towards the mouse, which is the center. And I'm going to once again draw my elongated dot. And then on this side, so once again it's at an angle. So say about right here. I'll draw my other arm towards the mouth once again. And another elongated dot. There. Okay, and so then now to draw her legs, I'm gonna come over here. Once again, it's just at a curve. And just make sure it's almost the same level and then over here and let's see here oh and of course let's give her um, a little bow <laughs> why not <laughs> it's a draw so cute frosty of course it has to have a bow <laughs> okay so there a little bow for her and of course she's got it got some sprinkles too that way you get to add a lot more color and fun to this drawing rather than just uh, vanilla or chocolate, right? Okay, so once again, come in here, just bring this in a little bit and it wouldn't be complete without some hearts. So right here, I'm just going to draw three little hearts and I guess it could get bigger as you go higher and one more. So there, my just so cute uh, Frosties inspired by Wendy's. Hope you guys love how it turned out. If you do, please give me a thumbs up and share it. And remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new just so cute videos. See you later.